This video covers the test method ASTM E1333 for determining formaldehyde concentration in air and emission rates for wood products using a large chamber. Formaldehyde is a naturally occurring, colorless, pungent smelling gas that typically exists in small quantities within nature, but its use in many industries has increased human exposure to this pollutant. This test method is a way to quantify how much newly manufactured panel products such as laminated particle board and Luan sheets contribute to indoor air quality and determine compliance with many regulatory agencies such as HUD and CARB. There are two main considerations when conducting the test, loading ratio and air exchange rate. The loading ratio is total exposed surface area of each product divided by the test chamber volume and typically is different for different types of products. The air exchange rate is the ratio of conditioned and filtered outside air brought into the chamber to the chamber's volume per hour. ASTM E1333 specifies an air exchange rate of half an air change per hour, so only the quantity of material tested differs between product types. The test samples are conditioned in a low formaldehyde environment for seven days before being placed in the 800 cubic foot or larger chamber. The test chamber is kept at steady temperature and humidity conditions of 77 degrees Fahrenheit and 50% RH. The large chamber test requires that the samples remain in the chamber for 16 to 20 hours before taking an air sample to determine the formaldehyde concentration in the air. The analytical method specified by this test method is a slightly modified version of the NIOSH 3500 method where air is bubbled through an impinger containing a 1% sodium bisulfite solution. This solution is then mixed with chromotropic acid and sulfuric acid to cause a color change proportional to the quantity of formaldehyde in the solution. The quantification of this color change is measured using a spectrophotometer and compared back to a calibration curve relating color to formaldehyde. The results of this test method are expressed as the formaldehyde concentration in air or emission rate or both. It should be noted that these results are only relevant to the specific air exchange rate and loading ratio used. 